Welcome back everybody. This morning we're making biscuits. So yesterday, well last night, I made this pumpkin butter right here to go with some pumpkin spice biscuits for this morning. I'm making most of these biscuits just my regular normal buttermilk biscuits. But I'm gonna make about three or four, we'll see how much we get here, pumpkin spice ones. I'm making like a, a recipe and a half today and I'm using self-rising flour, butter, and buttermilk. But I'll have the recipe down below for using all-purpose flour and self, you know, or self-rising. I think they come out a little fluffier with self-rising flour, but they're good both ways. And I also wanted to tell y'all because one of the last times I made biscuits, I was telling y'all about you don't want to overmix your dough. I can't remember if I said in that video or not, but I always have to add more buttermilk than the recipe says. I think it just says one cup. I always end up adding more than a cup because my dough feels too dry. So you just kind of have to go by feeling. It used to not, like I used to could just do that one cup and maybe just put a few drops more of buttermilk. Now I have to add a good bit more. So I'm not sure if it's because I, with the self-rising flour I need more or what it is, but I always have to add more. So you probably will have to add more buttermilk. That could be why they're coming out a little tough. So like see right now I put a little too much buttermilk. So I'm gonna add a little flour in here. I'm making a recipe and a half like I said so I misjudged that. But it's a quick fix. We'll just add a little more flour. Mix that in. So yeah I'm just gonna make about three or four pumpkin spice biscuits. Just we'll see how many how many we can get with what we have left out of this dough. It's pretty cool here this morning and I think it's gonna be even cooler tomorrow morning. I actually had to turn the little fireplaces on. <laughs> Those things work really good like if you don't want to turn the heat on yet but you just want to knock the chill out of the air. Also even when it is time to turn the heat on, I had several people ask last year if they run the electric bill up and they actually I think make it lower. You want to help? Cece wants to help with that. <laughs> But yeah, last winter, I really think that those fireplaces kept the electric bill from being as high as it normally is because it, it wasn't that bad last year. Definitely didn't run it up any for sure. All right, you got it? Uh -huh. Okay, so we're gonna see, I'm gonna do at least six or seven normal biscuits. pumpkin spice biscuits is add a little bit of sugar and I'm just gonna have to eyeball this because I just have a small amount here that was maybe a teaspoon and a half and now we just put a little bit of pumpkin pie spice I'm also just gonna eyeball that maybe about three-fourths of a teaspoon now we just mix these I was gonna make them in a different pan but they'll take the same amount of time to cook so I'm just gonna put them on this same one over here we'll just separate them from the other ones this is the same way like if you want to make cinnamon biscuits you just make the normal biscuit recipe and then you could add in a little cinnamon sugar and boom you have cinnamon biscuits make a little glaze to go on top selling pretty good hey a glaze would be good for these pumpkin spice biscuits too all right now these are going to go in the oven i'm going to clean this up real quick and we'll make the sausage and the eggs and i did i went ahead and set the butter out so it could be warming up it did pretty good coming out of the mold. The only thing that happened with both of them is the stem for the pumpkin broke off. The leaf stayed on, see the little leaf there? It stayed on, but the stem broke off. Not a big deal. I tried to stick this one back on, but it didn't want to. Maybe it will now since it's softened a little bit. There we go. This, I think this pumpkin butter would even be good with just a regular biscuit, like if you didn't want so much pumpkin spice action. <laughs> So I got the apple jelly out because I know they're going to want to put this on their sausage biscuits. Okay, the biscuits are done. So I brown them on top and I just spread, uh, put a little regular butter on top of the other ones. And on these pumpkin ones, we're just getting a little bit of our pumpkin butter and I'm spreading it over the top. You, of course, could, you know, slice them open and put some in the middle, too.
finished up with breakfast and I got the kitchen cleaned up. We have a few minutes before time to start school, so we're gonna come outside for a little bit. It's gonna be another pretty day. Manly wants to go let the chickens out. Come on. Let's see if we got some eggs. Flower. They know that's their feed bucket. Here they come. The pumpkin spice biscuits are really good. They're not very sweet at all. Like the biscuit itself, not sweet at all. Like I said, I just kind of eyeballed the sugar and the pumpkin pie spice, but the butter is a little sweet. So when I spread that butter on the top, the top of the biscuits were a little sweet, but not too sweet at all. So if you wanted it to be more like a sweet biscuit, you know, like a cinnamon biscuit or a blueberry biscuit, or Henrietta, you could make a glaze like we were talking about to go on the top and that would make them more like a sweet biscuit. But they were really good, the butter especially, really good and it would be good on a regular biscuit too. So it's day four of the collards. I watered them earlier this morning when I came out here. This one is definitely having some new growth. I don't know if y'all can see it too good. See all that? That's new, but the rest of them, I don't see anything going on yet. Over here, nothing really. I mean, maybe a few little things, but I'm thinking maybe I cut mine off too short because if you look at these and these, this one was bigger than, like longer than the other one. So maybe I cut these off too short. This one's definitely got new growth going on here. So if that one produces and these don't, I'm thinking that's what I did wrong. I cut them off too short, maybe. Jonah saved his last little dinosaur, you know the little eggs you can dig a dinosaur out of? He saved the stuff after it got wet. He saved it and let it dry back out and he hid a dinosaur in here for Manly. You gotta what? dig it out. Here's the fork. <laughs> Fine. That's a lot easier. <laughs> it's a windon. All right, it's time for school. Is the pteranodon ready? Yeah. It is several hours later. It's about 2.30 now. We need to cut the stem off. We need to shake it. We're here on the stem off. I didn't quite get that. We need a what? We need a shortcut cut the down. A shortcut? Yeah. I think it looks better with the stem, don't you? Think we just need to leave it on? <laughs> yeah, let's leave it on. We've just been sitting out here watching the leaves fall. Anytime there's a breeze, a few of them start falling down. There's still lots and lots of green, so not too many yet. So we're waiting on Titus to get here, and then we're going to go down to my mama's house. Cece's made her some pumpkin cookies. I'm going to take her some apple jelly and one of the jars of muscadine jelly. So we're going to go see her for a little bit. Tyler is the most excited of everybody, though, because he's going to be picking up a truck. My nephew has a truck that he's been thinking about selling, which he's more like my brother than my nephew. I'm only three years older than him, so we grew up more like brother and sister than aunt and nephew. Anyway, he has a truck that he's been thinking about selling, and when he heard Tyler was looking for one, and he said, yep, it's for sale. Since we're gonna be out anyway, we're just gonna get supper from somewhere tonight. Jake has to work, so he's not gonna be able to go with us to get the truck and all. But everybody else is saying they want Pizza Hut, so it's probably gonna be Pizza Hut again. Nanny's fall decor. Oh, I think this is a light up sign. We gotta ask Nanny what their names are.
sorry, y'all. We was all hungry. We didn't get a chance to let you see it. We grabbed it real quick. <laughs> <laughs>